What's up guys, it's Ruddy Crazy. I'm gonna show you today how to install Valheim Plus onto your PC. First thing you need to do obviously is have Valheim installed on your computer already via Steam. Next thing you need to do is bring up the Nexus Mods website. All the links that you're going to need I will provide in the description below. You need to go to the Mods tab and then go to Get Vortex on the right hand side and download the latest version of the Nexus Mods Vortex software. When the screen comes up, you need to go down and hit the manual download button. It will prompt you to log in or register an account. Obviously, if you don't have an account with Nexus Mods, you're going to need to create one. I already had one, so that was easy for me. And then, then it's gonna bring you back to the main page. It'll prompt you. Then you need to click slow download because we're not paying for premium around here. It's gonna take a little bit, but it's not gonna take very long. After that, download it wherever you want. When the download is finished, double click it, start the installation process. Obviously go through the prompts just like you would install any other program. Then when that pops up, it's going to say that there are checks that are gonna fail. You need to install some things. Just make your way through this process. Anything that prompts, feel safe in saying, okay, it's not gonna hurt your computer. I did it. We're gonna to play together. Get it done. Then you need to go to select games. You need to scroll down until you find Valheim. It's gonna say the game support is not uh, installed. Hit install. It's gonna make you log in via the browser to link up your Nexus Mods account to the Vortex account. Just go through, authorize all this stuff, hit the allow button on the diagnostics thing, or don't, I don't I don't care. Um, then it'll tell you that the game is not discovered automatically, you're going to have to navigate manually. So then you need to go to wherever you installed uh, Steam. For me, it's the program files folder, then you go to Steam, and then you go to Steam apps, the common folder, and then you'll find Valheim there, probably a lot more games for you. Select the Valheim folder, then select folder. It's gonna say you're missing some things, download those things. It's it's very self-explanatory. Everything's going to pop up for you. Allow it to do it. Uh, when it prompts you to download it, hit the slow download again. Wait. Install. And then it should tell you to open up Vortex. It's not going to pop Vortex back up automatically. I don't know why it doesn't do this. So you're going to have to actually open back, open Vortex back up. Again, if you want to allow them to, to do the diagnostics and the usage data, go ahead and hit allow. Then... We are going to go to our games. Actually, yeah, first, so you need to go back to the website, go to Valheim Plus, click the Files tab, scroll down to the BIP, BEP NX Valheim Plus Vortex, and hit the Mod Manager Download. Not the manual download. Then you'll do the same thing. It will download, and you will automatically open it in Vortex. Boom, you're going to have to bring Vortex back up once again. And then at the top right, you'll see that it is installing the mods. And when it's done, you'll click the mods tab on the left. You'll see that now you have Valheim Plus enabled right there in your mods tab. Should be ready to go. Um, don't mind any exclamation points or anything like that. Now, this next tab here is for the discard or recycle inventory uh, mod that basically allowing you to delete items instead of just having to throw them on the ground. It's the same thing that you did for Valheim Plus. Go to the Files tab and then hit the Mod Manager Download. It's going to prompt you once again. Go through the motions just like you did before. And when it asks you to open Vortex, you will. And then it'll do the same thing and the Recycle or Discard Items mod will be enabled automatically. After that, you are literally done. All you got to do Click play on Valheim and Steam. It should launch as normal. You'll have a, uh, a command prompt window that does pop up. Just leave it running in the background. It's not a big deal. Um, that is everything running and, and the mods running properly. You will see Valheim Plus now on your menu screen. That will show you that you did this properly. If it doesn't say Valheim Plus <laughs> on the menu right underneath Valheim, then something may have went wrong. Then you can just literally log into your account and... Create your character, play an existing character, whatever it may be, and you have full access to all of the Valheim Plus content. Now, by default, the majority of the Valheim Plus stuff is not enabled. So when I first dropped into the game, I had no clue what I was doing. Uh, you actually have to go in and edit files in order to get all of the Valheim Plus features. Um, for the sake of our community server, we are not going to be using a ton of the Valheim Plus features, but I did make some alterations to 
the config file, which I will also provide uh, a link to downloading that config file specifically in the description below so that you can all just copy it and paste it on top of where the config file goes and you won't actually have to make any changes to it. And that's really all there is to it. Uh, it's pretty self-explanatory. Again, I hope this video helped you guys get everything going. If not, you can always reach out to me on Discord and we'll get you set up and I'll try and walk you through it uh, the best that I know how. And I will see you guys in the community server.